Good morning, guys. Welcome to day 12 of uh, July and the Book Junkie Trials, and also day 2 of the Summer Biannual Bibliothon. I am in bed. It is currently, let's see here, 8.33 in the morning. I am in bed. Lauren is standing over here watching a show. Can you say hi? <laughs> uh, but I am still in bed. Uh, just because I'm exhausted. <laughs> um, I went to bed last night at a fairly decent time. However, Lauren over there, as well as Ryan, decided to wake up at 4.28 this morning. And I am exhausted. Uh, Ryan went back to sleep pretty quickly and we put him back in his own bed. Lauren, on the other hand, decided she was up, and she was up for the day. She has not been asleep since 428 this morning. She's going to be exhausted before long, and we have an appointment we have to be at at 1030. So that's going to be fun. Uh, but I figured I would go ahead and get this vlog started with me in bed. Because this is just where I want to stay. But I have so many things I need to get done before our, we have to leave the house before by 10.30 to go to the appointment we have. So I really need to get out of bed. So I'm hoping by telling you that I need to get out of bed, I'll actually have the motivation to get out of bed. Though it hasn't worked with cleaning my dining room yet because my dining room is still a mess. Yay! That's also on the agenda for this weekend because we're not going over to my parents house at all because they're not going to be there they're on their way to wisconsin today um they're going to the dells for a family reunion um so we are not going over to their house because you know we're not not gonna no we're gonna be there <laughs> so yeah we're staying here and so while we're here my plan is to do as much housework as i can get done that is the hope anyway so and also as much reading as I can get done, which is also the plan. So, yeah, uh, I figured I would go ahead and let you guys know what my plan was. So I'm going to go ahead and try and get up, maybe get some clothes on so that I'm not cold. Uh, get, like, some sweatpants on or something warm. Uh, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and go and I'll see you guys in the next clip when I'm hopefully, hopefully out of bed and functioning as a normal human again. So, see you guys here in a second. Hey guys, so we are out and about now, clearly. Uh, we just finished with the kids' appointment that they had this morning, and now we are on our way to the store again, because why not? Um, but we are on our way to the store again to get some just groceries, things that I didn't get yesterday. So we're going to do that now. And then after that, we're going home. Um, I figured I would go ahead and tell you guys about my reading because I haven't updated you on that yet. Um, so while we're out and about, I am listening to the audiobook for The Seven Husbands of Emily and Hugo, and I am really enjoying it. I'm probably about 100 to 150 pages in already, and it's really good, and I really like it. I'm honestly liking it a lot more than I expected to, mainly because the hype around this book was so great that I fully did not expect to enjoy it quite so much because oftentimes I've noticed that if the hype around a book is really great, either I go into it expecting too much and it falls flat or maybe I just don't enjoy it as much as everybody else. Um, but yeah, the, this book is definitely holding up really well and I'm really enjoying it. So that is what I am reading right now. I am also still reading Poison by Sarah Pimperoe. I'm still reading that. Um, I did not read any more of it uh, since the other day when I hit 16 pages. I was going to and I fell asleep instead. Um, and I don't know how much more of it I'm going to get read today because I told you about the kids waking up this morning at ungodly hours. So I don't know how much more I'm going to get read today because I honestly am probably going to take a nap at some point today because I am so tired. But I'm also going to drink some coffee when we get home. So hopefully that will help. Yeah, that is what we've got going on right now. So we're basically to the shore. So I'm going to go ahead and go and I'll talk to you guys in, in the next clip.
Hey guys, so I am back in bed. Um, I have a really bad headache. Um, so I'm back in bed for a little bit to see if I can like sleep it off. Um, but yeah, basically I got up this morning and I was, went out to my desk because I was going to go ahead and work on getting the vlog done and other things done that I need to do today. And, uh, and now... I am back in bed because it literally just feels like somebody attached like kettlebells to a rope and draped it around my neck and I'm wearing it as a necklace but George is out with the kids because it's Saturday and I'm back in bed for a little while to see if I can take a nap and get it to go away and then hopefully I'll get things done. If not, you will be seeing uh, two days in this vlog. Because if I can't get the headache to go away, there's no way I'm going to be able to edit today. So, alright. I'm going to check back in with you guys later. Hopefully with a less of a headache. Hey guys, so welcome to the day 14. Uh, so today, if you do not know, it's the 14th day of the Book Junkie Trials. It is the third or fourth day of the Summer by Annual Bibliothon and I have done zero reading today. I did a lot of reading yesterday, uh, which you'll have to go back and watch the vlog for that. Uh, yesterday's vlog was actually two days because I was so sick. It's actually two or three days. I'd have to actually check, but I was so sick yesterday, but I felt terrible. I had a really bad headache that was making me kind of nauseous uh, and I feel better today, um, but because of that, I couldn't sit and edit the vlog and get it uploaded and so there's a combination vlog of a couple of days because I couldn't sit in front of my computer and edit and I really didn't want to film. So it's kind of a terrible vlog for like a two day span, but it's there. <laughs> but if you do not know, the 14th day of the Book Dragon Trials was our first uh, competitive competition for the readathon, so we had to do a booktube scavenger hunt. Uh, I'm currently on my way to the grocery store after having finished the scavenger hunt, and I actually spent probably a good 20 minutes to half an hour sitting at my computer on Discord just helping people. Like, I told, I after I finished, I sent out a message that if you're struggling to find some people or come up with the answer, like to work on the clues, to message me, and I'd be happy to help out. And so I was kind of hanging out just trying to help people out as much as I could without giving away the answer uh, to like the final thing. Um, I try, I was trying to be as helpful as I could be because um, you know, it was hard <laughs> and it took me quite a while to find it. Honestly, I thought I was going to be screwed right off the bat because I could not come up with the answer for the first booktuber. The very first one, Rachel actually put the answer in the comments of the premiere so <laughs> it was pretty easy to find once I found it but once I she did that I was fine and like there were once I struggled with I was convinced I wasn't gonna get there at all but eventually I was able to do it which was great and <laughs> I think I got the right answer I guess we'll have to wait and see because I won't find out if I moved on to phase two until later but I am so happy that I did it like I finished it I was so happy um but yes that is what I've been doing today and now I'm on my way to the store because we need some groceries for this week so I'm doing that now and yeah it's been a fun day and I, I kind of hope that I make it to phase two just because phase one was so much fun and also it gives me a chance to get more points for my team which is what I really want to, to get as many points for our team as possible so yeah that is what I have been doing I have been uh, doing that today. I'm, like I said, now on my way to the store and I figured I'd go ahead and tell you guys about that and also my reading for today. Uh, I haven't read yet today. I'm going to read when I get home from the store. That's the plan, but <laughs> we'll see. So my plan is to continue reading the book that I started yesterday, which is The Irish Heiress by somebody, don't remember. This is an arc I have from NetGalley, which I told you about yesterday. Um, yes. This is an arc I have from NetGalley that I am working on. I like it. It's weird. I'm not sure it's my favorite I've ever read, uh, but this was the book that I picked for the challenge for a book with a beautiful cover for, so Glimmer, for the book checking trials. It is also the one I picked for, actually maybe the same challenge. I think I just did it for both. I'd have to check. Uh, 
to check, but I have it for, it fulfills the challenge for the Book Junkie Trials and also one for the Biannual Bibliothon. So I'd have to check to confirm which challenges it completes. I don't have that list on me, obviously, because I'm in the car. But yeah, that's what I am doing today, uh, is going to read that. I'm hoping I can finish it today because I would like to finish it and then get a review written for it and post it so that I don't have to think about it. Um, I started... <laughs> I actually started a proper vlog, vlog, I have a vlog, I actually started a proper blog where I can, on WordPress, where I can actually post the written reviews other than just on Goodreads uh, for the arcs that I read. I don't think I'm going to post a review for every book I read. I think I'm just going to post for either the one, all of the arcs I read or all of the like books I have really strong opinions on. So like if I read a book I absolutely adore and I have lots of thoughts on, I'll post there. Or if I have a book that I read that I have really negative feelings towards, I'll post it there. So yeah, that is what I'm doing, posting those things. Um, but I'm at the store now, so I'm gonna go ahead and go and I will update you guys later. Hey guys, so I figured I would go ahead and give you guys a wrap up for this reading vlog, this three day reading vlog, and tell you all what uh, I read. Um, so basically, um, I'm trying to think what I read on day one. I can't remember if I started. So on the first day, uh, I think of this video, I finished reading The Elite uh, late the night before. And then after that, I read The Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo, which I really enjoyed. I ended up giving it five stars. It was a really good book. But I finished that on Saturday, actually. And then I started reading The Irish Heiress, which uh, I really thought was pretty good. I finished it on Sunday night, so the last day of this vlog. And I finished it and I really enjoyed it. So and that is what I read. Uh, so over the course of these three days, I read two full books and a teeny bit of uh, The Elite. So yeah, I am already done with three uh, reading challenges. So I finished the adult book with The Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo. I finished a book you picked up based on the cover but for The Irish Heiress. And I picked up uh, my free choice with the elite. So yeah, that is what I have read so far. So yeah, that is, that's it. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this vlog so I can go ahead and post it since it's already very late. Uh, and I will talk to you guys later. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.